Where is everybody? Did you scare them away? I don't know. They're probably having lunch. Not exactly welcome around here. Probably not. You have any idea what Robert Barr is doing? Hmm? Doesn't handle things the way you would, if that's what you mean. He is shutting down rigs that are still producing. He's restarting old mining operations in places we don't even have a shovel. Why didn't you tell me about this? Because I didn't know you were interested. Besides the fact that you threaten everybody who walks in this door to disinherit them. Wait a minute. You're supposed to be shepherding this whole thing. It wasn't the general idea. You're supposed to watch over things while Cruz finds out if Barr had done something illegal to take the company and maybe it could be undone. You know, I don't mind you yelling at me and finding fault in everything I do, because I'm used to it. But if you're pushing Cruz, if you're the one behind it, I want you to stop. Not that he's needed any pushing, but why? Because he's doing things he has no business doing. What things? He has a lot of respect for his job, Daddy. He has a strong ethical sense about what is and isn't appropriate, sometimes to the point of being a little rigid, but that's Cruz. Now, all of a sudden, he's taking people and he's putting them through the police computer, taping private conversations, and that's different. I don't think he should be doing things like that, and the department is not going to put up with it. Maybe it has occurred to you that what's driving him is not the company. Maybe what's driving him is your fascination for the great Mr. Barr. You want to listen to yourself? You're protecting him from your own husband. You have no idea what you're talking about. Now, Daddy, I have work to do. So why don't you just go find another office to spy in? <laughs> 